We are rolling. What's the rest of the Spanish department? A field trip to Taco Loco. Taco Loco! <laughs> That's so funny. You're hilarious. Puns, but I'm actually not joking. The kids are learning how to make tortillas. Oh, right. Um, yeah, of course. <laughs> Um, that's such an important part of the culture. Mm -hmm. And the history of their food making is integral to... John and Terry had some kind of coupon that I thought, you know, had a lame idea. The last thing those kids need is more fast food. Yeah, uh, yeah, that's what I meant. <laughs> um, it sounds lame and those kids were huge. No, oh, and I don't mean that. I just wish that the restaurant had been more authentic. I feel like I have to try twice as hard to get them to, you know, take me seriously. Right, because you're attractive. Because I'm teaching Spanish now instead of auto shop. Oh, exactly. That's, that's what I meant. <laughs> yeah. I just want them to know that I can teach more than car repair. How is your day going? Not too bad. You know, it's always a challenge, but the kids are worth it. I'd love to hear how you get inside their heads. You know, it must feel great to know how you're helping them, you know, become better people. Just, not just become students. Yeah, you know, it does. Um, <laughs> but I have to be careful not to get them, you know, get too attached. I met a boy today who has a crush on me. A crush? That's uh -huh. cute. Uh huh. I guess it makes sense. He's an impressionable young kid. I'm a confident older woman, but not too old. And he still finds me physically attractive, or at least I think so. I mean, I'm not a supermodel or anything, but I hope I still have some qualities that a teenage boy would, you know. Yeah. And you have a, you know, you have a great sense of humor. Mm. 